Hello and welcome to Veracity BTE solved question number 4. This one is a frequently repeated question. Uh, the question says, is it advisable to spend money on space exploration rather than issues like eradicating poverty? Discuss. Remember that you have 20 minutes to plan the essay, type the essay and revise the essay that is read out and uh, you know, proofread, remove the spelling errors and the grammatical errors, right, that can reduce your score. So make sure that you allocate your 20 minutes accordingly. Your response will be judged on how well you develop a position. Remember that when the question says discuss, it still means that you have to develop a position. It still is going to look for a written discourse. A discourse is a powerful and compelling speech. Okay? And written discourse becomes discoursing in a written format, right? That is another thing that the software wants, right? So please uh, do not, uh, you know, give impractical or hastily thought out solutions. Take a minute to think of the answer before you start typing. And uh, the rest of the things are going to remain the same. Minimum 200 words, maximum 300 words. Organize your ideas in the structure. Uh, present supporting details, present examples, control the elements of standard written English, which is nothing but your grammar usage of uh, formal language, right, and good vocabulary. You can look at the sample uh, 90 level response here. Uh, this contains four paragraphs, around 250 words, and it was typed uh, in less than 15 minutes. Uh, proofreading was done and the points were reviewed to ensure that there was no error or there was no repetition uh, of the points. It was ensured that there was an example which is clearly, uh, you know, identifying the stand or the position uh, that the writer of this essay took. So, go through the essay, uh, read it. Uh, you can also use the phrases given in the essay uh, and if you input them in your essay, your vocabulary and your written discourse for uh, as well as your writing score is going to get boosted. And when I say it's a 90 level essay, right, this is the, uh, you know, the score report. You can see all our trainers are 90 on 90 PTE mentors. We actually speak from experience. Uh, we have been training for the PTE since 2009 and therefore we are, uh, you know, well versed with the exam, the software, what are the kind of things that it is looking for. Uh, like I always say, the PTE is not a test of purely English. It is a test of how well you know the PTE, right? Okay, so uh, to streamline, uh, you know, your attempts to boost your score, uh, please make sure that you follow the uh, strategies, right? Okay, and especially for writing, make sure that you get feedback from a trainer and focus on error correction for your writing section okay mugging up anything is not really going to help you there uh, because in the test you are going to be your natural self okay and remember that writing is not just tested on the writing section uh, your listening also has a written summary uh, aspect right in the question of summarized spoken text right so summary writing on your writing as well as essay writing as well as listening summary writing all these three are going to be, um, and in fact, even your um, type, uh, the dictation in listening, right? Okay, so both writing and listening sections are going to be affected by your uh, writing skills, okay?